We have reached the end game. Except for the that, fact that is actually the name of this episode. <laughs> Welcome back to Let's Play Trauma Center New Blood. I'm Red X Parasite. I'm Mary327. And this is the end game. Yeah, apparently. So this is actually going to be the, the last episode. Spoilers. <laughs> you know, wasn't that fun, Doc? You know, double spoilers. This is not actually the last episode. Yeah. Figured. Isn't your director here today? Why? Are you worried about him? He was satisfied with the results of the operation, so he returned to the lab. He said no further operations will be necessary. Then I guess you don't need us anymore, huh? Yes. And no. We just need to decide what to do with you. What do you mean? There won't be any more life-saving operations for the time being. But there are some experiments I'd like you to perform on human subjects. <sighs> Oh, only two this time. <laughs> I'm curious to see if it's I can not the most shocking thing that's happened in this recording session. Act. No. Will you wield your scalpel in the name of science? What do you say? I'd rather die. I'm a doctor. Find someone else to do your dirty work. Oh, come on. Is that the best you can do? Well, let's see how long your bravado lasts. Leland. I'll be taking them to their new cell tomorrow. Have it ready. Got it, boss. I'll show you what a mistake it is to let your conscience rule. Val, Elena. Yes? There's something I need to tell you. Okay. Is it about the choice they gave us? No, it has nothing to do with that. It's more of a confession. Back when I was helping the professor with his research, I made a number of genetically engineered mice for use in experiments. There was something different about one of them. It looked just like the others, but it held a terrible secret inside. You don't mean... It happened while I was operating on the subject's kidney. I was excising a tumor. That's when it came into contact with artificial blood and started growing at a frightening pace. That was the birth of stigma. Marcus, I can't believe this. I disposed of the subject and proposed that we put a halt to the research, unleashing a new pathogen into the world in order to study its treatment. I argued that that was the wrong way to perform research, but the professor wouldn't listen. That's why I volunteered to go to Alaska, and I should have just quit. I had no idea you'd follow me there and get dragged into this mess. I was desperate to study your techniques. But I never imagined that that's why you were there. You realize that I may personally be responsible for the advent of stigma? If it wasn't for me, none of this would have happened, and you two wouldn't be in this position. But I want you to know, as a doctor, I've always held the highest I mean, regard this doesn't for sound life. From everything you're saying, this sounds like this was completely unintentional. No, it really was an accident, but... Of course, Professor Wilkins couldn't let it go, so... Yeah. Don't be so hard on yourself, Marcus. That he's really the reason why this is all happening. Yeah. There are still many things we don't know about stigma. We need your help to unlock those secrets. Just so you know, Dr. Vaughn, I'll always be there to assist you no matter what. Until we die tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. Yeah, this sounds like if there's ever been a time for you to try to make a mad All escape right. attempt, sounds like bolts. it was then. Sounds like they've missed that point. Water torture is our specialty. <laughs> Let me tell you, it's a sight to see. And you know what's a sight to see? Your cotton candy hair. <laughs> Watching our adversaries scream as they get swallowed up by the cold, dark water. You think you can force us to do your bidding? Just holler if you change your mind, and I'll stop the water. But make no mistake, that'll be the last choice you ever make on your own. Thanks, but I think I'll stick with the original choice. I'd rather die than work for a scumbag like you. <laughs> You've got spunk, Doc. I'll tell you what, I'll do you a favor. When I bury you, I'll put surgical instruments in your coffin. That way, they'll be able to identify the body. I mean, they might be able to tell your profession, but <laughs> then I mean, it would help narrow things down. Up, a little. Hold on, Leland. 
use this. What kind of lock is this, boss? I found it in a toy store. I have no other use for it, so why not give it a try? We'll what? get a good laugh watching him try to unlock it. <laughs> what? <laughs> How far what? are they planning on taking this nonsense? He said he found this lock at a toy store. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I remember what? seeing a commercial for this. Something about this just went connect the four friends and release the lock. <laughs> yes. Why is he using a toy? What the hell's wrong with this guy? They must think we'll beg for mercy. But if we can unlock this, then we'll have a chance to escape, won't we? Yeah, but my bet is they don't think we can do it. Well, I'm not gonna let some stupid toy be the thing that makes us drown in here. That's the I mean, spirit. I feel like we the real way it. that this would work is it's plastic, so you bash it hard enough and it unlocks. I don't know if we have the appropriate things to do that, though. It's plastic. Your fist is probably fine. That would hurt. Other, uh, The alternative right. is Let's you die. We also have two minutes, by the way. Okay, so for this, you're, we're going to be using forceps the whole time, so it is A and B, and then you'll want to twist the remote to rotate the pieces. Square panels can okay. be rotated with the forceps. So the way that it works is that whenever you connect uh, the color from one of the two ends, it'll change that piece to that color, and you're trying to create a path between the two. Now, you can't have any of the paths cross, though, because then it won't go all the way from one to the other, so... Uh, okay. The way that we're going to want to do this is this one goes right and then down. That one goes like left and up. That one goes, uh, let's see, down that way. And then this one goes around that. Okay. Turn the panels and make a path using the lines. You said something about connect the four friends. So you want to start with blue and I'll start with uh, red. So, so what, what vague direction is blue? Make sure that you don't go outside of this range for blue. Okay. What do you mean by friend? Huh. Looks like they've started. Yeah, ramp. Ramp, I guess. Isn't this pretty hard for a... It's connected. Huh. I hear it's... So, he's one of those kinds of people. Oops. They can... All right. Just one more. Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh. I need this one, and then that one, uh... We there we it. go. And that was not bad, but I think we're probably going to get like a B it's... for it. Be quiet. <laughs> the timing is actually really strict. the Hyperlock 3000. The timing is really strict on this one. You have to basically do it, you know, now about as fast chance. as possible in order huh. to get a good rank on it. Hmm. Also, let's get a move on. I like how they don't notice that we unlock this. You know, why wouldn't they keep be keeping an eye on it... us the whole time? Yeah. Okay, so yeah. The, the bonus that we didn't get is for doing it in under a certain number of twists. Oh. Because we did a few more than, you know, is Needed. necessary. Hmm. Still got an A, though. Eh, yeah, close enough. Where are we? Outside! We're outside! And we're still alive. Uh, you might want to concentrate on getting yeah, out of there if, if you, you want to remain that way. If you don't shut up and run, you might not That's be for right. long. We were able to escape. <laughs> like don't they're going announce through it. that. Where are they? Where did they go? Oh Hurry up God. and find them. All of you. Come on. We have to keep moving. Over there. I see light. Sah. Might be able to get sass. We could get sass. Uh, that's if we get an S on this, which I kind of doubt that we will. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, challenge mission. Which means this will probably be a shorter episode. <laughs> ah, crap. My hand wasn't very steady for that. Mm. All right, um... I'll treat the tumors, you, t you treat the uh, inflammations, so inject it with the uh, blue stuff. Oh, okay. You can also get the vitals, too. Oops. I'm doing a swell job with this so far.
Oh, I gotta miss because the uh, yeah. stupid stuff came back. It's us. I mean, I know what it is, I just couldn't think of the word fast enough. Okay, now we need to uh, remove the appendix. Oh, okay. Game doesn't really explicitly tell you that, but... Basically, anytime you get this field of view... That's what that means. We're removing the appendix. This might be the last time it actually comes up, though. Hmm. I'm fairly confident that it is. There's my there's there. Yeah, so since this is a challenge mission, the uh, health does carry over between patients. Right. For whatever reason, you know. Yeah, which is why I figured I might as well take the time to work on that. Yeah, it is worth it. Yeah. Okay, uh, with this one, get ready to raise the vitals once we treat these. Um, yeah, more lacerations are going to appear and they drop the vitals pretty quickly. Okay. Sorry. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. There's, okay, there's still blood there. That's why I can close it. It was just behind my uh, pallet. Hmm. Alright, I think the, I think we just have to treat these and look good. I know there's at least two more patients after this. Maybe three? Fun. Yeah. Fun with a capital F. Because <laughs> it's for friends that do stuff together. <laughs> okay, you get the bottom one, I'll get the top one. Uh... Oh, uh, there are tumors. I'm not good at this. That's Porto. Yeah. And then two three, three times. Oh. Right. Oh, what? Why was that bad? How was <laughs> that bad? I swear the like the game's rating on the the big aneurysms is so all over the place. Oh, that one. I already got that one. I... Yeah. I didn't realize there was a difference. And there is a difference. It's not glowing red. Here, you get the one on the right. Get the one on the right. Do it. Okay. Down, 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 down. Nope. Okay. <laughs> this is going to burst if we don't do anything about okay. it. Okay. Well, I was making sure that we had actually gotten that one. Cause... We did. Okay. We cut it. Idols. That's a thing I should be doing, isn't it? Yeah, if you're gonna do anything in this situation, since you're just kind of sitting there and not doing anything. Yeah. You're running out. Yeah, but okay. Figured I might as well max it out and or, use them all and then let them recharge. See that one it gave me a cool four. I hate the angle on that one, it's so awkward. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I think there are two more. Okay. No, I ruined our chain, somehow. I don't know how <laughs> that one missed, to be honest. Yeah, that seemed like it was pretty clean, especially compared to some of the ones that it's perfectly fine with. Yeah, it, it's weird. It definitely is. Oh, well. We're not perfectionists, though. <laughs> yeah. Be here all day. Actually, this, I think, what, this one, I think, might be the last one. Okay, so with these, the angle that you pull them out at plus the uh, place that you put them in the tray matters in terms of uh, the ranking that you get. Nice. I'm going to put some stabilizer in them. You have to pull it out straight and put it in the middle of the tray to get yeah. it cool. 
Which can be difficult with the Wii's somewhat jittery sensor bar controls. Oh, that was apparently a bad somehow. I apparently did badly at putting something in a tray. It might have been the uh, way you pulled it out. Yeah, because yeah, I feel like putting something in a tray should be a pass-fail thing. I, it, you shouldn't be able to get a cool for putting it in the right spot on the tray. That's kind of dumb. Oh, hey, we didn't get a C. Oh, well, that's something. We got Sab. <laughs> Oh, if only those two were in a different <laughs> order. <laughs> ah. Ah. Hey, if we get a B and then an A, we're, we're good for ABBA. That's something. All right. Well, thank you for watching this episode of Drama Center New Blood. Caught myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've been Red X Parasite. I've been 327. Signing out. And in the next time, next time we will get to the urgent meeting, but that can wait until next episode. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs>